her 9000's game room. Okay, so recently we've seen trailers and gameplay footage drop for a game called Star Wars Squadrons, which is an upcoming space combat game set in the Star Wars universe, developed by Motive Studios and published by Electronic Arts. The game is set after the Battle of Endor, which appeared in the film Return of the Jedi. And apparently the story alternates between two customizable pilots who are flying for the New Republic's Vanguard Squadron and the Empire's Titan Squadron. This game can have both a single player and a multiplayer, with the multiplayer supporting up to 10 pilots, which will pit two groups of pilots against each other. As players gain more experience, they can unlock new weapons, shields, upgrades, and various cosmetic items for their pilots and ships. Now, I'm pretty excited about this game, mostly because when I grew up, you've got the game X-Wing and the game TIE Fighter, and then X-Wing vs TIE Fighter, but I also grew up playing a lot of the Wing Commander games and basically I'm ready for this sort of space combat. It feels like it's a long time since there's been a game that's been purely focused on that. I'm also a huge Star Wars fan, I used to collect the figures, read the comic books, watch the films on repeat, and even the games are very important to me. I remember playing the Atari 2600 Empire Strikes Back game so much and I even brought my GameCube to play Rogue Leader Rogue Squadron 2. In fact I remember the first time I played the like Death Star Trench part at the beginning of that thinking wow this is just how far Star Wars games have come on we can actually get to the point where it feels like you're in the film now. So you know to me this is a game which I'd sort of consider a system seller and it's great to see a style of game come back which I think has been absent for so long. And so far it looks like with the graphics, the sound, the style, the attention to detail, it just feels like they're bang on target to give us something a little bit special here. So I'll be waiting for this one with bated breath, hoping that it fills the void that's been left since I used to play a lot of Wing Commander games. I can't see that I'd play this that much in multiplayer, but I'm hoping there's a really good, strong single player story to work my way through. The one thing though, multiplayer, that they could offer that would really bring me to the table would be if instead of just doing a competitive multiplayer, they offered some kind of mode where you can have a team of five and you actually play missions like attacking Imperial installations, where you can actually feel like a squadron in a Star Wars battle in space with your friends all teaming together. Now that's something I'd love to see. And yeah, I'm excited about this one. I'm sure lots of other people are. That's Kerr9000 signing off saying keep on gaming.